Hey guys, what's up? Coming with you with just a small haul um, from Lord & Taylor. I don't know if you guys were aware, they did have their friends and family started last week, Wednesday. And it was supposed to end today, but I think I just got an email saying they're extending it to 2 a.m., especially online. Um, yeah, but just a couple things that I picked up from Lord & Taylor and some stuff I picked up from Cherry Culture. They had, I think it was... 25% off their China Glaze nail polish and it was just a couple more that I wanted so I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram you probably saw some pictures of the things well not everything just one thing that I'm gonna show you guys um I well I should say my hubby got me a Michael Kors watch from Lauren Taylor's if you guys don't know me I'm not a big watch person um most of the watches that I wear like I have a watch in gold silver but they're like you know they're pretty much under a hundred dollars I need to just wear them just for accessorize so I haven't had like a real watch in a long time the last watch I had I think I was 14 years old when my mom gave me this 14 karat gold watch and I could not tell you what happened to that watch because I'm just not big on watches so um during friends and family they have this watch that I guess this came out for the fall it's the Michael Core. I'm not sure the style of it, but it looks like this. And it has the diamonds around and it has the diamonds going down on this side and the same on this side. And this one, I believe the lady said it came out for the fall of, for this year. I'm not sure. It just says Michael Core and just like the style number. Yeah, that's pretty much it. But it looks like this. Block the glare for y'all. So this is the first real expensive watch <laughs> that I had, like I said, since I was 14 years old. So, yeah. So the girl, hey, girl has to have one good watch. So it came in this box right here. It's the Michael Kors box. And it has a little pillow and inside there's a thick little booklet that basically tells you about the watch and the watch was it gives you the style number originally it was I want to say I think it was 450 original was 450 but like I said we got 25% off the watch because it was friends and family and I think he paid like three something it was like three something but original price I believe was 450 and this little booklet, a thick little booklet, it is waterproof. Um, I was looking that up the other day just to make sure. So it came in this little box like this. So pretty much early Christmas gift, I guess. And another thing that I picked up for myself, um, I love Marc Jacobs shades. I don't have too many shades, but I do own one all black Marc Jacob, a pink Marc Jacob. And I think um, like a brown Michael Kor. I had a Dior, but I think I gave it away. But Marc Jacobs shades are my favorite ones. So I had my black one for almost five years. And it's the only shade that I pretty much wear whenever the sun is out. So I finally decided to get a new one. Um, the case they gave me is a Michael Kor case because they could not find a Marc Jacobs case to fit this one. But it is a Marc Jacobs sunglasses. And I love this because I have such like a kind of say I have like a you know I got a big head which I am aware of it so these type of shades the oversized shades always look nice nicer on me than any other type of shade but it says Marc Jacob right here and original price was 98 and it looks like this and it has the Marc Jacob inside and what I like about this one I don't know if you guys can see it inside here along right here it's purple I don't know if y'all can see that it reflects purple so this is a brown I got this one in um like the dark brown because like I said the last one I had was black so I wanted to kind of change it up and it looks like this on so I love these type of shades like I said they I don't know they just fit my face perfectly so it was originally 98 and with the 25% off I think I paid about 78 with tax almost $80 something like that and I actually went to Lauren Taylor because <laughs> I have three of my good friends birthday are in the month of November 
So I bought one gift already. Just in case she watches this video, I'm not sure. But I don't want to say whose gift it is. But I have three of them. That their birthday is the month of November. So I actually started their gift shopping. And like I said, these are three of my real good friends. So I got this one. Um, something from Coach. And I like this because it comes with this beautiful little gift box already. So I don't have to do too much, Um, you know setting it up or whatever but she's not into pocketbooks like me she usually likes small wallet or small things so I got her a coach wristlet and it looks like this and this I believe original price is it's 58 this is 58 dollars and it comes in black it comes in like a burgundy color um I didn't really like the black um I don't know me and my husband didn't really care for the black so I decided to get, we did, well, we decided <laughs> that he likes the brown one better. So we got her the brown wristlet. And this is just a cold wristlet. Like I said, this is one of my, you know, good friends. And I just wanted to get her something because she's not into like big bags or anything fancy. So this is for one person. And then the other two, actually, I'm getting them gift card um, from K, K Draw. I'm getting, I think, $100 each. They'll get a gift card. And then I'm. Pretty much it. That's it. And my little sister's birthday is November too, but I already got her gift. She got a pair of Uggs, so kudos to her. So enough about that. Oh, one more thing. My hubby picked up a shirt from Target that he loved. It looks like a plain black sweatshirt, but it has this like see-through right here, and it's just a plain. I mean, when I first saw it, I was like, okay, what's so special about this sweater? But it's just like a plain black sweater. But he loves the see-through pattern right here, and he loves the see-through pattern in the back right here. But just a plain sweater, like sweatshirt. So perfect for the um, for the fall, perfect for the winter. So when I picked up from Cherry Culture, like I said, they had 25% off on China Glaze nail polish. And I love when they do that because I get a lot of my nail polish, especially China Glaze. You can't beat the price. Like there is no other place you're going to buy China Glaze for so cheap. So I got this one, it's called, it's a trapeze, and it looks like this. I purchased this Aqua Baby. I don't have any color like this, no type of green. This is Budding Romance, and I thought this was a beautiful color because I have nothing like this in my collection. This one is called Avalanche. Which I thought was also pretty too. It's a little different. And I wanted like a lavender color. So I got Sweet Hook. And then I, I was watching. Um, I think it's Miss Rosh Posh tutorial the other day. And she used this NYX Ultra Pearl Mania. And this one I believe is called. It's in yellow gold to highlight. And I loved it. I love it. I love it. As a matter of fact, I put it on as a highlight today. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's right here. It just gives you this beautiful gold highlight. I thought it was so pretty. I love it. So I had to get it. So I think this was, I think it was $3.99. I'm not sure, but it was definitely under $5. And there's a lot of products in here. And it's called the NYX Ultra Pearl Mania. And it's in yellow gold. Beautiful. Makes a gorgeous highlight, guys. And one thing I love about Cherry Culture, I love their little lip treatment. I don't know, they're so moisturizing. They are so, I don't know, they're wonderful. And for $1.99, <laughs> you can't beat that. And then usually once you spend over $20, you always get one for free. So I got one in grape, and then I got one in strawberry. I already have like two more of these, but I have two that's like pretty much done. And these are my best friends. In the winter time like I have EOS and other expensive lip treatment lip balm but these just they just do it for me so yeah I love these little things you have to try these cherryculture.com definitely but it's pretty much it like I said this was real quick and short just coming in real quick um if you guys want to know I have um I want to say fix is it Fix and Drama? I have on Fix and Drama from the Retro Mac collection. And as you can see, it looks a little glossy because it is a little, it's not as dry as Talk That Talk. But, you know, it's a Retro Matte lipstick. But I added one of these on top of it. And this is why I have like this slightly gloss finish. So, 
it's just a little bit and that's it and that's just to show you how moisturizing these things are i love them but it's pretty much it for my haul um yeah that's pretty much it was just checking in with you guys but keep up with me on instagram i do post a lot of pictures like i said i just started instagram so i'm still kind of new and learning how to you know just playing around with it but yeah but it wasn't thank you uh i can't even talk <laughs> thank you for stopping by and watching my channel welcome my new subscribers do not forget to comment rate and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video